Yo. How everybody doing today? What's up, black people? I want to talk this notion of everything. I'm off today. I ain't got to work today. I'm so I'm so happy I ain't got to go to work today. I'm off and enjoying my day off. But I want to talk about this whole situation that they say there are no good black men. It is BS. It is it is for gazy. That that whole notion there is no good black man or a, a, a false advertisement. <laughs> it is great black man out here, phenomenal black man. You just don't want to be with them. You just don't want to be with them. You say they are too bland. They are too boring. That's the great black man. See, Dr. Ben Carson, you call people like him a lame. You call him an Uncle Tom. But don't you know Dr. Ben Carson is from the streets of Detroit? He made it out the ghetto. He couldn't read or write when he was 13. He stabbed somebody who was 13. He could have went either way. He could have been Pookie and Ray Ray on the corner. You would have liked him more then. But see, our problem in the black community, too many of our women like inmates. I had a woman tell me that you don't understand why women mess with dudes in prison. Because the guy in prison was was uh, sexing her mind by by making her think, what can a guy in prison do for you? He's not free. You got you got women as sheriffs losing eighty thousand a year jobs, use, losing twenty year pensions. A fucking sheriff took a gun or a shake or something up to an inmate. You gonna lose your pension for some Pookie and Ray Ray? That's the problem. You are dating Pookie and Ray Ray. And not, 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 not Carlton, because he's too lame. Not Steve, because Steve works at the job. Not Jerry, because Jerry's too nice. See, that's the problem with black women. Act like a good man won't protect you. See, the problem is, y'all, y'all get this all wrong. See, a bad man, he argue at you and cuss you out and call you all kinds of names and disrespect you. A good man, he's soft on his girl and he hard on the world. Can I say that again? Soft on this girl and hard on the world. Stop telling their lies that is there. There's no good man. That is a lie. You just not dating them. And let's keep that real. You just not dating them type of men. You go out here and get these guys that ain't got nothing going on for themselves. You... I'm starting to think that women think that these bad men, they can change them. You can't change them. He's not going to change. You're going to be the same. Before you know it, you're going to be that 50-year-old out-of-shape woman with all them kids. And he's going to be in jail, in and out of jail. And you're going to be thinking you happy with this guy and you ain't. You're going to die miserable. You hear me? Or do you want to have a good life? Because women that die happy, they look more younger. They're more youthful. They live a longer life. But a woman that's always stressing and by herself, she die early. So take these words to heart, because I love black women, but I just want y'all to choose better. Stop saying there's no good black man, because the ones you're dating, they are no good. Peace.